Hey YouTube, welcome back. My name's Mori and today we're breaking down why Nintendo will likely release a new version of Animal Crossing New Horizons pretty soon. Now, just to be clear, I'm not really talking about an actual update, but rather a brand new physical copy like this that includes all current updates as well as the Happy Home Paradise DLC on the cartridge. More on that in a second. So if you're excited to hear more, be sure to leave a like on the video and subscribe so you always catch the latest Animal Crossing news as and when it happens. And let's get into it. So here's the thing, currently Animal Crossing New Horizons is shipped with one of nine versions, ranging from version 1.0, which is of course the first print and launch copy of the game, all the way through to version 1.8, which was the Mario update I think. Which version you get on your cartridge depends on when the New Horizons cartridge was printed and shipped out by Nintendo. To summarize, if you have a sealed version of Animal Crossing New Horizons from 2020 is probably version 1.0 but if you go out and buy a physical copy now it will almost certainly include a more recent update and most likely be version 1.8. This means no matter what version of New Horizons you buy it will of course be missing half the game. You'll be missing the Sanrio update, the updates to May Day and the wedding season for example, various seasonal events and items and Let's not forget the entire 2.0 update including gyroids, Brewster and the Roost, Cap'n and his boat tours, Harv's open air market and an absolute wealth of features, furniture and clothing items amongst many other things. The point is this is a nightmare for preservation and when the Nintendo Switch eShop shuts down one day, everything past version 1.8 will be lost. And that's where this lovely Photoshop illustration of Animal Crossing New Horizons Plus Expansion Pass comes in. It's pretty obvious to me that at some point Nintendo will need to release a new version of Animal Crossing New Horizons patched with the most recent 2.0.6 update which of course includes everything we mentioned earlier as well as all bug fixes and go as far to include Happy Home Paradise on the cartridge. Ignoring the 2.0 update and the bug fixes for a second, it would be crazy for Nintendo to not release a physical copy of Happy Home Paradise at some point. It's basically a game in its own right, so bundling it with New Horizons so it's not only a digital game makes sense. Anyway, Nintendo have of course done this before and specifically done this with Animal Crossing. Animal Crossing New Leaf released in 2012 on the 3DS and four years later they released a huge DLC update featuring new villagers, new content, new items, you get the idea. And of course re-released a patched version of Animal Crossing New Leaf including this DLC expansion on the cartridge as a new version of Animal Crossing New Leaf under the name Animal Crossing New Leaf Welcome Amiibo, which again turned out to be super important given the 3DS eShop eventually shut down. And if they hadn't of released that physical version of the expansion DLC, we would have lost this massive update including Harv and all of the RVs. Anyway, you might be thinking this is pretty irrelevant given we're talking about the Nintendo Switch, but let's not forget we are coming to the end of the Nintendo Switch's era and the eShop will probably shut down within the next 5 to 10 years or so. The 3DS eShop was only a thing for about 14 years and the Switch eShop is already 7 years old. Anyway, we're getting, we're getting sidetracked here. The good news is there's more evidence to support Animal Crossing New Horizons getting a new version at some point in the near future. And that's the simple fact that Nintendo are already doing this with other top selling Nintendo Switch games. Splatoon 2 and Splatoon 3 both have physical copies with their respective DLC expansions on the cartridge. No internet or update required. How cool is this for preservation? Pokemon Sword and Pokemon Shield both have physical copies with their respective DLC expansions. Zelda Breath of the Wild 
also has a physical copy which, you guessed it, comes bundled with its expansion pass which is 100% on the cartridge. I can link, get it, <laughs> a video on YouTube that proves this for those interested. And if you're looking for another example, Nintendo recently released a new version of Mario Kart 8 Deluxe complete with the expansion pass again all on the cartridge. There are others, but these are probably the most notable and top selling Nintendo titles. Now, some of these are exclusive to Japan, unfortunately, such as Zelda and Mario Kart, at least at the time of making this video, but the Zelda version can be played with the English language and there are Western releases of the rest, such as Splatoon and Pokemon. So re-releasing these Nintendo Switch games bundled with their respective expansion passes and DLC both together on the cartridge is already a thing. Just as a side note, please be careful if you are looking to get any of these by the way as some versions have the expansion on the cartridge whilst others come with a download code. So just wanted to add that something to think about. Anyway, back on topic, given Animal Crossing has a history of re-releases with bug fixes and bundled DLC and now we're seeing a pattern of Nintendo re-releasing physical copies of their top games also bundled with their expansion passes, I don't think it will be long at all until we see Animal Crossing New Horizons plus expansion pass. I mean, this is something Nintendo could drop just before the holidays, for example, to help boost their Nintendo Switch sales towards the end of the year. Again, if we look at the top six best-selling Nintendo Switch games, half of them have re-releases that include their expansion passes. So really, there's no reason why Nintendo aren't, at the very least, contemplating giving Animal Crossing New Horizons the same treatment. And at some point, releasing New Horizons and Happy Home Paradise all on one cartridge. And from my point of view as a collector and Animal Crossing player, this would be incredible for preservation and amazing if the New Horizons cartridge included everything released since launch without requiring access to the eShop or even an internet connection. How cool would that be? Personally, I think it's inevitable. I think we will see it and I think it will be soon. The downside is there's always the chance it will be a Japanese exclusive like some of the others. Fortunately, if that was the case, I'd imagine we'd still be able to play it with the other language settings like Zelda, but of course we'd have to wait and see. So there we have it, just some food for thought really. Of course, if you made it to the end of the video, be sure to post expansion in the comments. It really helps out. And be sure to include what you think. Would you like a new physical version of Animal Crossing New Horizons? Would this make you play Happy Home Paradise finally if you haven't already? Or do you just like the idea of a deluxe version of Animal Crossing New Horizons bundled with Happy Home Paradise all on one cartridge for your collection? Be sure to let us know your thoughts in the comments below. Don't forget to leave a like on the video on the way out and subscribe so you catch the latest Animal Crossing news as and when it happens. Thank you so much to the Patreon and channel members for supporting this content. I'll see you in the next one. Peace.